huge update. I am getting roommates. <laughs> I used to take myself out on dates. Open my own damn doors. Happy Monday. Sorry about the air conditioning. It's very, very hot today. It's 2.48 p.m. I've just been doing some work all day. Last night was the friend miss. I ended up getting home just before midnight. So I haven't gone to the gym this morning. I was gonna go with my friend, but we both bailed. So, gonna go tonight. Um, but I've just been editing the weekly vlog, sorting out some dates for next year as well, trying to find some form of balance. I wanna be able to work with all these amazing brands, but you gotta find that balance because obviously I don't want every single thing I do to be sponsored. It's really exciting when you have all these brands wanting to work with you. So, I'm just trying to plan ahead. It's wild planning videos literally for June and it's December. Pfft. I've just mixed in Genora. Got right, and my greens powder in this. Kinda tastes weird, but it's fine. Last week was insane. I am just, not necessarily in terms of like working busy, but just having lots of things on. I feel like this time of year, everyone is so busy with social events, even though work is calming down. Every single day last week, I had something on, but I think I am quite tired. Wednesday, I'm getting a lash lift. I'm also getting my lips done and my masseters retreated. I haven't had my lips done since March, I think. I think I get them done every nine months or so. It's a little bit more than once a year. And then my masseters kind of every five months. Just helps with teeth grinding, tension. I've been so stressed the past couple months, obviously. So that'll be nice to have some relief. Friday's Christmas Eve and I have something with my family. Saturday's Christmas. It's 3 p.m. How is it 3 p.m.? Night for the life of me and I haven't and I haven't had that in a long time so I think it would have been like past midnight by the time I actually fell asleep so I'm feeling a bit tired this morning it's 6 50 a.m. holy moly but I'm just making I feel like outfits just look so different because my hair is a different color. It's oh, I just scratched my face. Like, ow, Connor, what are you doing? Okay, just ignore the red mark on my face because I just scratched myself. So we've got a few new collections launching. We've got studio, we've got pores, and we've got adapt ombre, which is coming soon. All the info will be down below as well. This little portion of the vlog is sponsored by good old Gymshark. So these are. So Super different and I love that. Oh, I love that color. These are from the studio collection. Nice. This is like the sports bra to go with it. Oh, yes. Okay, no padding. That looks gorgeous. I think that'll be super flattering. I love the back of it. So this collection's designed specifically for like yoga and Pilates. Not that that's too high intensity. I love this color. It's like a peachy terracotta pink. This is another one from the studio collection. So just in black, the same crop. And then this is from the Paws collection. I actually really like tops that have necklines like that, where it's kind of like a thicker triangle on the edge. I find it to be super flattering. Ooh, I love that. So this is more athleisure wear, not designed for anything crazy. So you can definitely, oh my God, that color. So you can definitely wear this over the top of active wear. Oh my God, they're so cute. I'm definitely taking some of this with me to the sunny coast. Oh, I'm really excited now. I've been wearing a lot of green lately because as I've said a million times, I think it goes really nicely with my hair. So these are the shorts, cute. They look like they're gonna be nice and flowy. This is one of the tops. I've been really into wearing like big t-shirts over my active wear. And this one has a little hole in the back of it. And it's super, super lightweight because the only bad thing about wearing big t-shirts is sometimes they can feel heavy. So if you get one that's meant for active wear, then it's much better. So this is the new Adapt Ombre collection. I love Adapt Ombre. I think it looks very flattering. Oh my lord! Woo! Holy moly! Look at those! 
I don't think you realize just how bright they are. I'm normally an extra small in the bottoms, but I think they accidentally sent me a small. So they might be a tad too big, but you can see they're kind of a little bit longer. So they're more of like your cycling short. Absolutely stunning. And then we've got the matching long sleeve crop. I'm gonna try these on and see how we go. All the launch info will be on the screen, but I'm pretty sure some of this is already live. So, oof, that coffee is not sitting too crash hot in my stomach right now. Okay, it's now like 10 something. I'm having a weird mood day. You know when you're in one of those moods where you're kind of bored, but you know you need to rest? Don't ask me why I'm wearing jeans in summer. I also don't know whether these make me look ridiculous. Sometimes I feel like I look so small, but these jeans are from Pretty Little Thing, by the way. They're like the boyfriend ones. These are in a size four. They're very, very oversized though, which I love. And this is a crop from White Fox. And then these sandals are Princess Polly. They're so cute. I just popped on some makeup because sometimes putting makeup on it makes me feel more productive. Like I wanna get stuff done. Here she comes. Now, I have to go to the post office. Excuse me. Why are you so excited? Look at you. You crazy pup. You crazy pup. Come on, have some. Also, not to like toot my own horn, but my back muscles are pretty popping. Like I was looking at it before. Wait, can you even see that? I don't know. My upper body has always developed very easily. And I think that's a result of gymnastics. Comment down below if you did gymnastics as a kid. You just seem to forever maintain muscles. Getting my bags for the supermarket. It's like we're on the edge right now. My 10 foot cord that I got from Amazon no longer works anymore. I feel like non Apple products tend to do that where they just suddenly stop working. Oh, I'm just in one of those moods and it's annoying because I want to be a productive queen and I am not in the mood to be. What do you want to listen to? Shuffle play. Billy. <laughs> Sometimes sunglasses are a very nice accessory even if you're not going to wear them. Pretty sure that song has been in my top songs for the past few years. <laughs> okay, so got back from the supermarket. Not great. Someone did ram a trolley into the side of my car. We don't love that, but hopefully it'll get sorted. First world problem, but it's never nice when something happens to your car. Firstly, I have one from Dermalogica. I don't know what this is. Ooh. We've got this one here. These would be really good gifts, actually. And then a hydration set. My mum would probably really like this because it's like the more mature skin. Both of my parents have incredible skin. Even though I had acne, like really bad acne, quality of my parents' skin is really good. Like my dad, he's 64, I think, and he like has no wrinkles. Ooh, this is from Daniel Wellington. Oh, cute. I think I have this, but this one has little sparkles on the edge of it. Aww, that's so nice. Thank you. Okay, and then from Anna Louisa. Oh, a jewelry care kit. Actually, that's really handy because sometimes you want to clean your jewelry. Ooh, cleaning spray. The difference when you clean jewelry, I think I've used I think I've used Windex before. Don't know if you meant to do that, but so what have we got? Ooh! Oh, I like them. They're like little dangly. I like diamantes like this when it's on gold. Oh, my eyelashes like stuck together because I, I did have a bit of a cry, not gonna lie. Oh, they're really pretty. And then we've got a really simple little ring. You can see that there. Lovely. I love how minimal Anna Louise's packaging is. I honestly feel like I just wanna watch a movie after this and just sit on the couch. I think that is the mood for today. Honestly, Skins are true. We've got a very, we've got a theme of, wow, I got four packages and it's, and it's skincare and jewelry. It, so many brands have like lots of kits coming out around now because it's obviously Christmas. So that's a real cute, I actually really like the bag. So, thank you so much guys for sending me some goodies. Always appreciate it.
Okay, it is Wednesday. I just finished up getting my lashes lifted. I didn't even film because I was just brushing. <laughs> but I think this is like the best one I've ever had. Look at that. So nice. I go to Mariana and she is incredible. I'll leave her Instagram on the screen. We were gonna do my brows, but I need to duck off to my beautiful appointment now, which actually works out really well because I'm pretty sure it's quite close where I'm at. Um, okay, just all the appointments this morning. 10 minutes away. Stunning. Did wash my hair. I'm gonna see. I'm meant to be getting it done in late jan but i'm gonna try and move it forward i think just because just because i don't want it to fade to red but i still really like the color like i kind of like that it is warm like i don't think it looks bad i also think it kind of complements my eyes as well and as a kid i had pretty red hair because it's my irish roots coming through hence the name connor yeah i'm gonna head off now let me like concentrate because i am in a small car park and my car is pretty large so wish me luck obsessed with my lashes though I think we're gonna do half a mil just because don't need too much I think it's slightly uneven if you can see I think this side so just a tensely once a bit I'm not excited to get my lips done though because it's like it's not that bad but it does hurt and then this is a bizarre feeling it feels like you're getting a pimple popped inside your jaw it's bizarre. It's so random. And when you hear like the crackling, like sound. yeah, it almost feels like like a blind pimple being Literally. popped. These are what my lips look like. Obviously, they're swollen, so they're gonna go down. And then my mask is you can't like see because it's not filler or anything. It's just it goes into my jaw. But I had some pizza for lunch. It is so hot today. I keep thinking it's Friday. Like it legitimately feels like Friday. I don't know why. Probably because it's that time of year. Also, thank you so much for all the love and support on my in the comments and stuff lately. You guys are so lovely, so lovely. So I can't believe what's the 22nd tomorrow's christmas eve eve i need to shut up no one cares <laughs> So it's a bit sweeter. Um, so I did 50 grams of banana, about 125 grams of just frozen cauliflower. I don't cook it, just frozen. You cannot taste it. It's like the perfect vegetable to make it real thick and creamy. And look at that. I also have a discount code with my protein as well now, which is super exciting. So I'll pop that on the screen because I'm not exactly sure. I think it's just Connor, but it'll be on the screen, which is super exciting. So I just got this at the door. Dear Connor, on behalf of the White Fox team, we wish you a very Merry Christmas. Thank you for all of your support. So nice. They're so pretty. <gasps> Look at them. Shall we? Look at them. 
That's so lovely. Thank you so much. They're so beautiful. Oh, oh my god, there's baubles in here. <laughs> Aww. morning guys happy thursday these are what my lips are looking like still kind of swollen and bruised a little bit um i just finished up at the gym did a strength session i'm about to take charlie to the vet um this is the lash lift how beautiful like that's just come on Sunday. It's the 26th of December right now. Oh, there's a beer bottle on my <laughs> um, TV unit. I have no idea what this vlog is gonna look like. I decided to get myself ready today. Literally yesterday, I didn't put any makeup on. I pretty much just cleaned the house and then I went over to my parents' house, had lunch, and then we came back here and opened some presents and I watched Dexter. So that was my Christmas day, but I hope everyone had a good Christmas regardless of where it was if it looked a bit different this year. These are Jazz Handmade hoops that I got in a package the other day. She also sent me um, one of the new rings, which I really love. All right, just don't forget Charlie in the background. <laughs> Charlie is recovering well, because she's an absolute trooper. Huge update. I am getting roommates. Okay, I'm in here. In my last video, I spoke about how living alone is really getting to me and I'm just not loving it. I'm not thriving, especially working from home. It's just, I'm alone all the damn time and it's very, very hard. And as an introvert, I like being alone, but not to this extent. And therefore I've decided to get roommates, housemates, flatmates. So that is so exciting. This has been in the works for a while. I just haven't mentioned it yet. So Elise and her partner are gonna move in here. So I've mentioned her a few times on my channel. She's been in a couple videos, but she has a, like a furniture restoration business. So she's like done up my TV unit, the bar stools. It's just, she's, she's been on the channel like a little bit. So her and her boyfriend are gonna move in to this room. I think today they might start moving some stuff. So yeah, you might see some other people in these videos, obviously they're not going to be in the videos because I never want to shove my camera in people's faces. Like, hey, you just woke up. Do you want to put your face on the internet? Probably not. That's my decision that I do to myself for some reason. So if you're like, oh, why is Elise suddenly in your videos all the time? That's why. So just want to give that huge update. I'm very, very excited. I really want to have some normality in my life because my life is not normal. It's not normal to do YouTube and to, in my mind, to like live alone at 22. It's not normal. Obviously people do it, but it's not common. So I'm just excited to have roommates, have some normality in my life and to have some company and not be so lonely. And I'm super excited for that. So I'll be coming into this room. So it's nice and I need to move some stuff out. But my parents have moved into their house. So they took out the bed that was in here. So yeah. There's not much more to say. So that's the spare room. And this is the spare, spare room. These are my dad's shoes. But this bed's gonna stay in there. So you guys have seen, I, cause I kind of cleaned it yesterday. So this is the bathroom. Just so it'd be nice and clean when they move. I really need to declutter my beauty room because it's so messy. I the dining table didn't end up coming either, which is a bit sad, but I think super understandable because of like COVID and whatnot. So no dining table yet. I haven't really heard anything. Like I don't know where it is. They said they would send me, it said it would take two to three weeks. I think it's been about three weeks. So let me show you some Christmas goodies that I've got. So my brother's girlfriend got me, oh, there's dog hair on that. One of these little candles. 
which I love, which I'm not going to burn, obviously, because it's so pretty. So I think it goes really well with my, like, body candle. It smells really interesting. I quite like that. And they also got me a little gratitude journal, which I know I have had so many people tell me that I need to start journaling. And it's just, I haven't ever gotten into it, but I know so many people love it. So that could be really great. I don't know what's, what brand it's by. It just says gratitude journal. And then my parents. <laughs> if you haven't seen any of my videos, you won't get this. But if you're a subscriber and you watch my videos, <laughs> They got me a pizza board. If you know me, I love pizza and I make it all the time. Although I haven't been making it as often lately. Purely because they've been sold out of the pizza bases that I love a lot. So this is going to be so amazing. So it's got like divots in it that I can use this to cut and get perfect slices every time. They look like quite large slices though. But I just think that's so fitting. <laughs> These are my lips too, by the way update they're a little bit sore still like swollen but they've gone down a lot so they're not so crazy but i posted my 2021 recap video which essentially is just a compilation of photos and videos and i love watching it it's so cool Holy moly, I'm sweating. She's back from the supermarket. So, I'm not gonna do a haul because it's literally the same thing I get every time, but I've been super into seaweed snacks lately. They're so easy and they're essentially, if you care about cows, 26 cows. Um, these, I normally get like, they didn't have the normal ones, they had wasabi, I hate wasabi, and they had spicy kimchi. So, let's give these a whirl. Whoa, they're pretty spicy. They're not as like salty as the, oh my lord. They are spicy. Wow, wow, we wow. I think I prefer the original, but they're quite good. So just from the, they just look like that. Now I know this is super unlike me, but I kind of want to take down the tree just because it does take up a lot of space. I mean, I could move it. Mm. I don't know, I kind of want to take it down. No. No, I won't do it today. 